If anyone knows how to party, it is Shaq. The basketball legend just opened up about some insane stories back in his glory days. He recounted on his crazy party days and it sounds like the craziest of nights always involved fellow basketball legend Dennis Rodman. When looking back on those crazy nights with Rodman, Shaq recalled, Shaq, Kobe, and Dennis Rodman on the same team. Who's the biggest superstar? You, you, you ain't gonna hurt my feelings. Just say who biggest you Biggest superstar? Shaq. Yeah, on that team. Shaq, gotta be Shaq. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, say Dennis Rodman. I've seen this dude play a full game, don't take a shower, go to the club, and some of the baddest women I've oh. ever seen in my life. <laughs> Shaq tells one story involving another A-list actor. He says, I once walked into one of those parties. Leonardo DiCaprio's there, Robert Downey Jr., he's there. All these cats making weird faces. It's dark as hell, people are drinking. D-Rod popping Cristal champagne, showing off. A lot of stars, a lot of girls. Some of them taking their tops off. I just got out of there. Game at 7.30, we gotta be there at six. He come in at 6.45, late for the meeting, eating chicken and rice. Take a cold shower while we talking, then come out and play. After the game, put his stuff on, go to the club, and the baddies come out. Shaq and Dennis Rodman are two of the most colorful and memorable players in NBA history. While their on-court skills were remarkable, it's their larger-than-life personas that often steal the spotlight. To shock Shaq, you know things had to get crazy. Shaq is no stranger to crazy parties and lots of girls. In fact, Shaq recently decided to shoot his shot at Ice Spice. During the Super Bowl, Shaq posted a group shot with Taylor Swift and her entourage, a group of at least six people. But Shaq called out one group member in particular, Ice Spice. Shaq captioned the photo, and Ice Spice is so d fine thanks Taylor Swift tagging both artists. Shaq was married to Shawnee Henderson from 2002 to 2009. The couple has four kids together. However, Shawnee just opened up about her time married to Shaq. And until I found that voice, and that's what I talk about in the book, just kind of finding my mm -hmm. voice, finding my purpose, because we all have one, and and just honing in on taking some you time and realizing that you were here for a reason and you deserve love, you deserve happiness and admitted that his wondering eye was a big part of the downfall of their relationship. Like any big athlete, girls have been throwing themselves at Shaq for years. Although Shaq loved his ex-wife, Shawnee, he seems to be better off living the single bachelor life. In fact, he loves the nightlife so much, he is actually a big time DJ now. His career in music started back in the 1990s when he released several rap albums with his debut album, Shaq Diesel, going platinum. Now, he continues to dominate as a DJ and seems like he is having a great time doing it. Needless to say, Shaq and Dennis Rodman are two of the most iconic figures in basketball history. These two legends are never far from the spotlight.